Okay, <laughs> this is take number, I don't even know what, of trying to do my absolute favorite idea I have ever had for The Sims. Hopefully this time it works. We are doing what I like to call every occult gets a cult, which is made possible by Get Together. So here we have our three kind of pre-made sims for this challenge. We have Raven, Peyton, and Allie. I'll kind of introduce each of them as we go, but the idea is each of them has been tasked with recruiting a new vampire for their cult. So every cult in the end should end up with six sims, and we'll do this for vampire, well, obviously vampires. We'll do this for mermaids as well, uh, ghosts, aliens, and I refuse to buy the werewolves pack, but I do have a werewolves mod so we can sort of work them in that way and every occult that we get uh down the line as well and we might even do like the unicorn cult if we really want to but um sort of i have some ideas for how i want them to recruit their new members so Raven, honestly, is kind of my favorite. I'm super sorry about that, but she is. She is, and Peyton are both musicians, so she plays the cello, he plays the organ, as is appropriate for vampires, I think. But she specifically is in the entertainer career, so I'm going to have her meet some people at work, and hopefully we meet a vampire, because she's taking the lazy approach of recruiting somebody who is already a vampire and dragging them over into our side of town. Whereas Peyton went for, rather than turning a vampire or finding a vampire, he's going to make a vampire the old-fashioned way, which is by romancing a sim up and making a baby. So that's going to be fun. That's been glitching. That's been the hardest part. But at least now that I'm recording and not streaming, I can pause and deal with all of the stuff that comes up. And last but not least, we have... Uh, is this Allie? I think this is Allie. Let me see. Yep. This is Allie Andrews. She so far has the most knowledge. She has been doing all of the vampire research. She's going to go find the vampire tomes, but she spawned in Create a Sim with a wedding dress as her formal wear. So I sort of have this lore going on where I think that she was turned into a vampire and killed before she could get married. So she has this whole, like, lost love syndrome thing i don't know where she's going oh there's a there's a oh, i do need a bed at some point we will have to do that um but there is a coffin up here so i'm guessing she's going to bed we don't have anybody having claimed anything and it's a bit of a mess because they do kind of keep walking in on each other but it is one in the morning so we have some time the hardest one is going to be Peyton because I think pregnancy takes like three sim days. Let me move my mic back because I feel like it's just straight up in my face. So we're going to go, I think this is part of relationship overhaul, to the meet and mingle app. And sort of select our, not victim, um, our mark, I guess. It's kind of a con uh, for who's going to make our vampire baby. So you can sort of get a sneak peek of the mermaid cult with Anastasia over here. So we can't use her. Um, I think she's in a relationship. I'm like, I am using the the world for the Not So Berry Challenge, so we'll get to see them sort of pop up every now and then. Greta Laurent, I don't, I don't try to go for townies, but she might be an option. She's kind of pretty. Let me see. Oh, Jade Rosa would be kind of fun. <laughs> this is the girl from the education, like, the college thing, right? I feel like Kiana Flynn would work. What is on her face, though? <laughs> I don't know. We could always go for Lilith Vator, have a guaranteed baby. I don't know. Misty, hopefully, is not a... I was going to say, hopefully, is not a teenager, but she wouldn't be on here if she was. Don't have children. Oh, doesn't want to have children. Maybe she would just hand the child over, though. You know what I mean? Oh, and she just wants to make friends. You know what? He loves a challenge. Let's just go for it. Um, hopefully this doesn't limit my chances of being able to use the try for baby uh, interaction, which is actually the, the part where the game has been glitching. But we could try the vacation rental. I'm sure it has beds. No, we're going to use our own house. I feel like that's just super creepy and on point for this. Um, let me go ahead and get us a bed and move the computer out of this room, actually. I, uh, you know what? I'm gonna sell this one. And I'm gonna move these coffins so that we are not so, like, 
in the middle of where everyone goes to bed with our woohoo. <laughs> woohoo double bed over here. Hold on. So let me just pop these over here. I'll grab this guy. Hopefully this works. I guess he could go here. Okay, because we do need lighting in that room. I know you can cough in woohoo, but I don't know if you can cough and try for baby. So I'm just gonna get us a double bed so that we have the best chances possible here. All right, so all the coffins are in this room now. That makes it easy. It means I don't have to move the computer. And then there is one other thing that I messed up when I sort of decorated this house. This is a pre-made house in the career world uh, save file, but I got the wrong globe. So let me just put in an actual bar really quick. Um, I want the globe bar. Yeah, so this is kind of what I was going for at the time. And then I want to just set up like a table and chairs so we can, <laughs> um, you know, maybe have a drink while we're trying to romance this this girl that obviously is uh hopefully going to give us her child <laughs> it's just so creepy if it wasn't the sims absolutely insane okay so now we are all ready to go she should be outside theoretically yep there she is um okay let's see I hope he's not in a relationship already. That would be super awkward. He doesn't really have any... Oh, I should go down one level. He doesn't really have any vampire points, because so I can't get what I want, which is the vampiric charm over here. But someday, if this doesn't work with Misty, we're obviously going to have to do it. Where did she go? Oh, there she is. We're obviously going to have to do it. Uh, ooh, I can invite her in. I guess she's not a vampire, so that isn't such a big deal. More... Where is my romance option? I swear this game is trying to kill me. <sighs> do I not have romance options? Wait, do I have it with these guys? No, not that. Hold on. Hold on. Ah! And he's in his underwear. This is going splendidly. More choices. Okay, I do have it with this. Maybe I don't have it with her because she wants platonic relationships so already off to a terrible start but let me just you know introduce myself i guess and say hello that could be is that vlad i think that's vlad friendly friendly introduction i think this is vlad we could romance vlad <laughs> oh my gosh this girl's expression that is exactly how i would feel talking to vlad okay okay sorry enough of this he should put some pants on but um maybe that's his tactic he's just going for hey look at all the stuff i got you want some let me get some pickup lines if we can get them going <laughs> oh my goodness gracious hold on ah what if i like compel her to be a willing victim would that make her more interested in me or less interested in me <laughs> It's funny because when I originally started, if you still haven't introduced yourself, when I originally tried this, I almost got it to work. I uh, had never played with vampires and now I feel like I'm a pro after three attempts at this. But this is going to be the one. It's the uh, third time's the charm, you know? Yes, I know summer vacation was awful. I refuse to play any of those like pop-up things. Oh, okay. We we do have romance. I just hadn't introduced myself. Obviously, I was getting ahead of myself. I'm staring at your heart. <laughs> I feel like such a con artist playing as the guy trying to, like, get in the girl's pants. Who inspires... I'm not staring at you. <laughs> this is killing me. Oh my gosh, this is great. This is grand. I'm having fun. At least I'm still having fun, you know? Um... Ha ha ha, hilarious. Are those bats? That better not be Vlad. Vlad, go away from me. Thank you. Oh, wow, she gets romance super easily. <laughs> what do you like to do for fun? Did you sit in sugar? <laughs> I swear, if this guy does this whole thing with no pants on, I'm gonna laugh my butt off. Are you are you just gonna stand there talking to yourself? Hold <laughs> on. They keep doing this where the sim walks away and then they just, like, don't know what to do. They're playing chess. How nice for them. Can we... Oh my gosh, I did all that and didn't get the double bed. <laughs> Hold on. 
<laughs> who was yelling at me while I did that? I'm so sorry. Okay, double bed. I'm gonna go like right there. I don't know what this rug is either. Hold on. We don't need that. Double bed, double bed. Where are you? Let me see. Usually, what is this? Is this a pod? Oh my god. Sorry. <laughs> I got distracted. What is this? Is a headboard? <gasps> what a pretty headboard. Oh my goodness. Okay, I can do this. Hold on. I can do this. I need to pay attention. This one. I usually go for the sixum bed. Did you know sixum is Max is spelled backwards? And how many times am I going to say that to you before you get annoyed? <laughs> um... Oh, woohoo bed mattress. Perfect, perfect. It's very fitting for the purpose of this bed. They better be able to get in. I'm gonna be really, really upset. Okay, yeah, there's space. What happened with the floor plan? Oh, this is so upsetting. I'm just gonna put a rug over it and I'm gonna call it a day. I'm not gonna call it a day like that, but you know what I mean. You know what I mean. Why am I picking the rug like it actually matters? It's just gonna be a rug. Okay, that doesn't help. Obviously, this is why I should have picked the rug like it matters. <laughs> this is so ugly. Oh my gosh. Okay. Oh, actually, it's pretty in the end. Not bad. Okay, I did not think that rug was going to go in two pieces and still look good, but it did. You know, from the side. I am trying to find this chick. Look, I kept on track. I kept the good night, beautiful. Oh my goodness. No, 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 no. Compliment appearance. We need to have first kiss and then try for baby. You're like sunshine on a rainy day, which would kill me. So no, that is not a good pickup line. Okay, I cannot first kiss yet. It is 3 a.m. and I have made no progress. And to be honest, she's kind of freaking out because she looks like a teenager. Should I pick a different person? I'm gonna pick a different person. Would it be bad if I invited over another girl while she's here? Hold on. <laughs> Just ultimate player mode activated private messages. Bro. Sure, you can like rascals and pessimistic sims, but you interrupted what I was doing, so I'm very upset. Browse all profiles. Okay, last time I did try the Cheyenne wolf person, and it wouldn't let me try for baby, and I kind of want to do it again, but if it doesn't let me try for baby again, then I'm going to have wasted all my time. We're going to have to restart this episode, so I would be very upset. Um, let me, let me see. I don't know. I like, I, is something wrong with me that I want? I don't have children. I can always edit her in cast, right? Screw it, let's try it again. <laughs> she's really freaking me out. She looks like she's 12. I think that's just the outfit. Oh my gosh, her face. She's like scandalous. Absolutely scandalous. Great. Let me go uh, try Bachelorette number two. <laughs> I am terrible. Uh, respectful <laughs> introduction. I always forget that that's, a uh, from the, uh, all right, they're friends now. That's nice. Were you, were you gonna introduce yourself? Did she just move super fast? That freaked me out. Cheyenne Black Wolf. I just thought it would be funny because it'd be like a werewolf and a vampire hooking up and making a baby, even though I know she's not a werewolf because I don't have the werewolf pack. Vampire. I'm gonna turn her into a willing victim. This can be my my approach number two. So we have two two options. I kind of want there to be three bachelorettes just to make it kind of funny. But um, let's just try. Let's do our best with this one first. <sighs> Why do they always go to the computer? Is she gonna come? Who is this guy outside? Is it? Wait, 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 wait. Is it who I think it is? No, never mind. I thought it was the goth family come to bother us, but no, no. Well, apparently he likes that one better. But too bad. So sad. Can we call over? Can we can we play the game both both ways at the same time? That would be really nice. Except she left. I swear these Sims, I should just turn off their autonomy every time I think this that I try this. No, we can do this. I believe in us. 
friendly introduction. I love that howdy, respectful, and friendly are all in the same pie menu. Somehow that just makes sense. Actually, while we do this, where are these two? Oh, perfect. Can y'all go outside and spar so we can get your vampire points up? Chat here. Hold on. I'm going to queue up some, uh, some romance. What are these called? Interactions? How have you been? I've never met you before, so I don't think that works. Propose crazy scheme. No, I lost kind of like my my cool romance flirtation things from my menu, which is quite upsetting. Oh, your hand looks heavy. There we go. All our pickup lines. Tense! No, it's tense. Your voice is magnificent. Tell gross joke. No, make vampire pun is actually kind of funny. funny. All right, let me go spar these guys. I don't think that is actual English grammar, but it's fine. Uh, okay, so I go here. I'm so good at vampires now. It's beyond, beyond funny. Vampiric spar, fantastic. I, I wonder what that other girl that we brought over here is doing. She's probably on the computer. Yep, called it. <laughs> All right, he's all like, hey, your hand looks heavy. Let me hold it for you. That's so thoughtful. Your voice is magnificent. Have you ever, ever read the vampire newspaper has great circulation? I love a good pun. I really do. Uh, that you sweat glitter. That's kind of weird. Not going to lie. Oh, kiss hands. Kiss hands, actually, from what I understand, does increase your romance pretty, pretty fast. Let me try it. Oh, she's leaving. <gasps> we'll invite her back later if we need to. It'd be kind of awkward if we left her here while we made the baby anyway, so. <laughs> well, day one's going well. <laughs> Absolutely nothing productive has happened. It takes so long to make a baby, like, without cheating. I mean, it's, it's, it's still pretty fast by, by everything's terms, but. <sighs> okay. Do I need to get rid of this computer? I'm going to lock this door. She's so close to getting in, but I'm going to lock it. Lock for... Actually, can I do everyone but family? How do I do everyone but family? Or everyone but household members? Actually, honestly, I've never had... No! Don't do it. Did she do it? Did she succeed? Where did she go? <gasps> I'm so upset. Alright, well... <laughs> Claire only wanting to hook up. I could, but I won't. We gotta, we gotta play the long game here. Ooh, have magical first kiss in air. It doesn't actually count as our first kiss, but I just think it's great for the occult. Are you Wi-Fi? I'm so curious what that is, but I have a mission. I am on a mission. Physical intimacy, first kiss. Okay, we're doing, we're doing good. We're okay here. It's fine. This is fine. I'm doing well. Did you all's points? Oh, their points did go up. Okay, so I need this one again. She, hers did not go up. We actually have to take her to the library so she can get into the vampiric tomes soon anyway. But, you know, like I said, pregnancy takes a long time, so we do have to get it going. Can I, can I, speaking of which, can I succeed at that yet? Because if I put all this investment into her and once you're funner, then bubble wrap. No, we're not asking about marriage. No, no, no. Wait, why can't I do it? Your Sims household, why, what do you mean my Sims household is too big? Excuse me? Oh, her household is too big. I can fix that. Super easy. This makes sense. It wouldn't even give me the option before. I love it when it tells me what I'm doing wrong. No, it's not a sentence I ever thought I was going to say. <laughs> Probably gonna have to get rid of one of her cats. <laughs> this is her household. That. Oh, they just have too many horses. All right, which horse are we getting rid of? Justice? Saffron? <laughs> Buck the pirate horse? No, Buck's my favorite. Precious or Lightning. To be honest, I don't think Justice is uh, gonna do it. And I kind of want to have twins, so one of the other knights needs to go away. Either Precious or Lightning. I feel like Precious can go away. Okay, we're good. We're good. This is great. Oh my goodness, I have such optimism now that I know what I was doing wrong. I hate when I feel absolutely autonomy-stricken by this game. 
and, and not their autonomy, mind you, my autonomy, because I can't do something when it breaks. It's a lot of loading screens, I do apologize. <laughs> Alright, we're gonna make a baby, we're gonna go to the library, we're gonna meet people at work. Actually, does she need to go to work? It hasn't been popping up to tell me to go to work. No, in two hours. Okay, hold on. Hold it, the phone. Can I try for baby in the coffin? This is something I'm very curious about. No, I can only woohoo. Try for pregnancy! Hooray! The option! He did this? Oh, she said, I don't want a child right now. Okay, well, can we woohoo and then accidentally get pregnant? No, I lost the ability to woohoo with her altogether because she doesn't want to have- I swear. I was feeling so good about myself. I'm so mad. I'm genuinely so mad. <laughs> Alright, well, bachelorette number three. <laughs> when I give myself challenges, I forget that they're actually challenging. Just gonna be like, oh, sorry. <laughs> Not interested in you more, bye. Can I say I want to be hookup friends? Is that something we could do? Oh, she's mad. <laughs> yeah, I would be mad too. I am mad too, actually. It'd be no so nice if I could just have babies with the men. Well, this is the one we originally went for. Piper Ernst. Piper already has three babies. <laughs> Uh, in one of my other trial runs for this, we did choose her, so I feel like I guess fate just went, nope, you have one option. Oh, she has no clothes. I totally forgot. It keeps removing her outfits specifically. She just has no outfits except for her underwear. And last time I gave her outfits, but I'm feeling this time she's still here. I was going to say, I'm feeling this time like she matches in the underwear with him who has tried this whole time. Can we, can we regular woohoo? No, this is very annoying. Is it because, like, we lost our romance level with that that try for pregnancy? Look at me. I am doing the player game so well today. Emerson, I can't right now. She's here somewhere. <laughs> maybe, maybe my roommates can, like, keep her busy for a sec while I try to do this. My family thinks we're dating. <laughs> no, you're better than a unicorn. Uh, not I'll do- actually, what if he's, like, just totally a simp now that she's rejected him? Oh my goodness. You know, I just feel like if he- if he could spread his wild oats a little bit. <laughs> I feel so bad saying that. But we'd have a higher chance at getting a vampire baby. Will she not do anything physical with us now? I'm so sad. Oh, okay, they can still kiss. <gasps> okay, regular woohoo. <laughs> she rejected him again? Oh my gosh, wait, 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 wait. I'm gonna try one last time. And then we're just gonna move on to the next contestant. <laughs> what do you mean you can't reach the bed? What did I- that girl is calling us too! Oh my gosh, it's so chaotic. I cannot, honestly, this whole- this whole episode is just gonna be getting one recruit. Is this gonna have to be three parts focusing on each person? I swear, I thought I could multitask. Why can they not reach the bed? Is it locked? I don't think I locked it. Can you reach- can you reach the bed now? <laughs> can you now? Isn't that a Spongebob thing? Can you hear me now? Alright. My patience is ending. Why? Uh. Alright, can you do it in here? Okay. Good old coffin woohoo. Absolutely amazing. The animation for this is hilarious, not gonna lie. And just while she's on the computer. All right, let me go find the other bachelorette. <laughs> She's somewhere in the house. Oh my gosh, my voice even knew that it was bad. Look at her in her underwear. Should I give her clothes? I feel like I can't at this point. It's become a thing. Romance, flirty introduction. We're doing a great job over here. 
I'm just, I'm gonna try for baby with her and regular woohoo with the other one. We're gonna hope that it's risky in some variety. We'll see how it goes, you know? Doing it in front of her is gonna make her jealous, which is gonna crack me up, actually. Is he burning? Is somebody burning? What is this animation? Okay, I don't know. I don't know. It's gone. Look at the two underwear sims doing their underwear things. Oh my goodness. I swear, once we do these two, I am leaving him alone and we're never playing again. This is so hard. Why is it so difficult? She looks pretty good for having had three babies. Are you a cat? <laughs> Should I play the organ and- can I serenade her? No. Gosh darn it. That would have been hilarious. Uh, okay. Romance. Flirt. My voice is going. Let me just, like, deal with this for a second. Okay, have they- how's their- oh, their bar's going up. Slowly, but- ooh! Mercilessly tickle. We can snuggle because we're on the couch. It's kind of fun. Actually. <laughs> oh, I can give her a massage. More. Okay, can we do our first kiss yet? Romance. Physical intimacy. No? Excuse me? Well, I can do the Sims 3 makeout. <laughs> I forgot I downloaded this. Oh, this is not safe for work. <laughs> That's not as bad as I remembered it being. I mean, it kind of is because they're in their underwear. So I'm going to sneak over here in case YouTube has... There's a dog! <gasps> there are two dogs. Oh my gosh. Hold on. Let me just soak this in. I put, like, um, dog friendly? Is that what it is? On the house traits? Because I know that Raven keeps befriending dogs. And I want her to get a stray of her own. <gasps> friendly introduction to the baby! Hello! I love German Shepherds, and this one in particular looks really cute. Uh, so y'all need to say hello. Have you done- have you finished doing the- yeah, okay. <laughs> um, they are fully clothed, so you know. It's not that bad. Can I do first kiss? I can do that first kiss. Yes, first kiss. Okay. I got a crumb on my lozenge. It's very annoying. That was startling. Can I just like... Oh, gonna, no! Do not... <sighs> she left. Ask on date. <laughs> Is he sweating? Is this kind of cheating? And honestly, it's cheating by me uh, <laughs> just sending them back to the same place. But uh, did I not take, hold on, did I not take the garlic wreath down? I have three vampires living here. My goodness. Terrible sim god. Okay. Where is she? Focus the camera. She's all the way out here. Oh, I can't go out in the sun, so she better come inside. Was she thinking about Cheyenne? She's like, that's my competition. Oh, they have amazing compatibility. Oh my goodness. Okay, okay, she's in the house. I repeat, the target is in the house. Oh my gosh, look at this face. I swear. <laughs> um, did we do first kiss? I can't remember. Woohoo here? Apparently we did. Mm-hmm. <laughs> This one! Yes! I was so close. I was going to be so mad if she left. Is it going to let him use the bed this time? I should put the walls back down. Mm. She said yes. She obviously likes babies if she has three. Look at the dog! <gasps> the dog's like, I accept my mission. Where's Allie? It's not Allie. Raven. Where's Raven? Raven, say hello to your dog friend. We are going to adopt him. Alright, she's taking her sweet time. But they at least made it to the bedroom. <gasps> he 
his name is Michel, Michal. I don't know. Don't go in that room. Don't go in there. Things are happening in there. <gasps> We're acquaintances. Offer friendship. It might be too soon. I'm gonna give a treat. I'm gonna get to know. Oh my gosh, I'm so happy for her. Like, she had befriended somebody else's dog. Previously. <laughs> He's actually pretty cute. I will, I will give it that. But we need our own dog. Can I... Am I friends enough that we can adopt him? Oh no, we can't adopt him yet. Well, we're at least friends, so I can invite him over again. Alright. Uh, have you done? It takes forever. It takes forever. Once they do that, we can go to the wishing well. I'm actually going to stop the episode and make the wishing well part two because this is already going on 30 minutes just trying to get this man a freaking vampire child. But at least we got a dog friend as well, you know? No protection was used. Good. Never thought I'd see that either. Is he staring at the bowl? <gasps> we need to get... Hold on. Before we end this episode, we need to get our good boy a uh, dog food stuff. Pets. I do have some really cute pet stuff, actually. This one fills up with water. I think it works. I haven't actually tried it before. I should probably put it downstairs. Not in the bathroom. Okay. Whoops. That's not right. Alt. Maybe right there okay absolutely wonderful thank you for joining me if you want to see not raven if you want to see ali's part in finding love and recruiting a vampire to the cold come back for part two uh you know where to find me B -b -b bye bye